In this case, we have a one-view chest x-ray performed portably in the ICU. This is an AP view of the chest, where the intent of the exam is to find the placement of the central line catheter. We can see on this image that the central line comes down into the SVC, but finding the tip of the catheter can be a challenge with the overlying anatomy. We have blood vessels and lung markings that superimpose over the end of the line. In most cases, a technologist will create a companion image that changes the contrast and sharpness of the x-ray in order to help the viewer assess the positions of lines and tubes. But this does not remove overlying structures. With spectral DR, users get two additional images at the cost of zero extra dose to the patient. Of the two images, one shows all the soft tissue structures by removing the bones and other hard anatomy, and the other shows all the bony structures by removing the soft tissue anatomy. In the bone image, we can see further without having to contend with overlying soft tissue structures. We can see just the hard structures, giving us the exact location at the end of the central line, one rib lower than appears on the DR view, when assessing the position of the lines and tubes portably, it is important to the person inserting the object to be able to tell the location and if they need to advance or retract the tube. Removing superimposing structures from the image helps remove this guessing.